Hi friends, welcome to Varlakshmi's Physics Classes. In this video, I am going to explain the neat previously asked questions from units and measurement. Let's see the first question. A physical quantity of the dimensions of length that can be formed out of C, G and E square upon 4 pi epsilon naught is. Here C is the velocity of light and G is the universal constant of gravitation and E is the charge. Let's see. So, length is depends upon C, G and also E square upon 4 pi epsilon naught. Okay, we have to find the dimensions of all this. For example, let C power A and G power B and E square upon 4 pi epsilon naught is C. Let it be like that. Let us find the dimensions of all this. Here given that C is the velocity of light. So, dimensions of velocity are L t power minus 1. Okay. And uh, another one is G. Universal constant of gravitation. For that write the formula of gravitational force. That is F equal to G into M1 M2 upon R square. Okay. So, here we want G. So, G is equal to f r square upon m1 m2 now write the dimensions of force here that is n l t power minus 2 and here r is the distance between the two masses so here distance is expressed in terms of l and square is there so l square upon for mass m1 dimension c dimension is m and for mass m2 the dimension is m2. Now do the calculation. Here m and m will get cancelled. The remaining terms here it is m power minus 1 and l into l square that is l cube and here it is t power minus 2. This is the dimensional formula of g. Let us find for e square upon 4 pi epsilon. For that write the formula of electromagnetic force that is f equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught into q1 q2 upon r square ok here q1 q2 are the charges so here i am considering instead of q1 q2 e so force f equal to 1 by 4 by epsilon naught into e square upon r square ok from this we can write it as e square upon 4 by epsilon naught is equal to f r square now write the dimensions of force here that is m l t power minus 2 and also for r that is l square is there so l square which is equal to m l cube and uh, t power minus 2. This is the dimensional formula for e square upon 4 pi epsilon naught. Okay. Now let us substitute all these three values here in this equation. So we will get L is equal to dimensions of C R L into T power minus 1 all to the power of A and G. See here M power minus 1 L power 3 T power minus 2 power B. And here it is E square upon 4 pi epsilon naught that is M L cube T power minus 2. Now multiply the power into inside the brackets. So L power A and T power minus A. Here it is M power minus B. L power 3 into B. So 3B T power minus 2B. Here it is power C is there. So M power C. L power 3C. And T power minus 2C. Now compare the terms C here for L. Write the dimensional formula of length that is L power 1. Okay, compare on both sides. First compare the M terms here. So here mass term is not there. So 0. 0 is equal to. Here it is. Minus B. Here it is plus C. So that implies B equal to C. Next compare the length term. Here it is 1. Here A. And here it is 3B. Next here it is 3C. Again compare the time term. Here time term is not there. So 0 equal to. Here it is minus A. 
next here it is minus 2b and here it is minus 2c okay here we got b equal to c substitute here so 1 is equal to a plus in the place of b we have to write c from this so 3c plus 3c so 1 is equal to a plus 6c here we got now substitute here also in the place of b as c minus 2c minus 2c so 0 equal to minus a minus 4c that implies a equal to we got it as a 4c okay now substitute a equal to 4c here in this equation so 1 equal to sorry here it is minus 4c so minus 4c plus 6c so 1 equal to 2c that implies c equal to 1 by 2 so we got the value of c now substitute the value here we will get b is equal to 1 by 2 so we got b and c values now substitute here we will get a a equal to minus 4 into c value is 1 by 2 so it will get cancelled two times so a is equal to minus 2 so we got a b c values now substitute in this equation let it be 1 substitute in equation number 1 so l is equal to c power a a value is minus 2 and g g power b value is 1 by 2 and c here it is e square upon 4 pi epsilon naught power c is there so c value is 1 by 2 okay this i am writing as 1 upon here minus c is there so 1 upon c square into g e square upon 4 pi epsilon naught whole to the power of 1 by 2 so this is we got here let's check up the options see d is the correct option i hope you understand let's see the next question planck's constant h speed of light in vacuum c and newton's gravitational constant g are three fundamental constant which of the following combination of these has the dimensions of length let's see l equal to h let it be h power a and for c power b and g power c okay now we have to find the dimensions of all this then we will substitute in this equation let it be equation number one okay so we know that for first find the dimensions of the Planck's constant for that we know that e equal to h nu from this h is the Planck's constant and e upon nu okay here e is the energy now write the dimensions of energy here that is m l square t power minus 2 upon here nu is the frequency so write the dimensions of frequency that is t power minus 1 now do the calculation so we will get m here l square and t power minus 1 this is the dimensional formula of Planck's constant next we will find for C, here C is the L into T power minus 1. This is the speed. Okay. Next, uh, for G, for that write the formula of gravitational force F equal to G into M1 M2 upon R square. So, that implies G is equal to FR square upon M1 M2. Now write the for dimensional formula of force that is m l t power minus 2 and r is l square upon for m1 m and m2 is m. So m and m will get cancelled the remaining terms are m power minus 1 and l cube t power minus 2 this is the dimensional formula of gravitational constant let's substitute all these three values here so l is equal to h we got here it is m l square t power minus 1 power a 
and for c l into t power minus 1 speed next g value that is m power minus 1 l cube and t power minus 2 here power b and power c now write the dimension formula of length that is l power 1 which is equal to multiply a inside the brackets m power a l power 2a t power minus a and here it is l power b t power minus b and here it is m power minus c l power 3c and t power minus 2c now compare on both sides first compare the m term here so here it is no master so 0 equal to here it is a and here no master here it is minus c so that implies a is equal to c here compare the length term here it is 1 equal to 2a here it is b next plus 3c okay now compare the time term here time term is not there so z 0 equal to here minus a here it is minus b here minus 2c now substitute a equal to c in this equation so 1 is equal to 2c plus b plus 3c so 1 equal to 2c plus 3c is 5c plus b now substitute here also in the place of a we have to write the c minus c minus b minus 2c so 0 equal to here it is minus 3c minus b so that implies b equal to we got minus 3c ok now substitute the value of b equal to minus 3c in this equation so 1 is equal to 5c minus 3c so 1 is equal to 2c that implies c equal to 1 by 2 so we got the value of c now substitute here so a is equal to 1 by 2 now substitute here also b equal to minus 3 into c value is 1 by 2 so b equal to minus 3 by 2 so we got the values of a b c now substitute here in this equation number 1 so we will get l equal to h power a that is 1 by 2 and c power b that is minus 3 by 2 and g power c is there so c value is 1 by 2 this I am writing as see here h power 1 by 2 and c power 3 by minus 3 by 2 and g power 1 by 2 now here it is just I am writing g h under root and upon c power 3 by 2 ok this is the answer we got let us check under root h g and c power 3 by 2 see here a is the correct option let us see the next question if force f velocity v and time t are taken as fundamental units then the dimensions of mass are so write the formula for force f equal to mass into acceleration so f equal to mass into formula for acceleration is velocity upon time from this mass is equal to f t upon v so f v power minus 1 and t see this is the dimensional formula for mass f v power minus 1 and t see here d is the correct option I hope you understand. Please do like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching this video.